Beggars can't be choosers, but beggars never quit. Height here, and you already know what this is. It's time for choosing beggars. Let's do it. Our first one is from Student Conscious 1070. In search of a dragon costume or mask. If you know anyone that can make one by 3 7 2024, I know it last minute. They don't mention anything about pay, and we all know how that plays out. They're probably wanting it for free. This next one is by That I Am Introvert. Can you do $35? If you can, I'd be willing to meet today. Where could we meet? Here. Could you meet me in Bankville? For the full asking price, plus extra for gas and time, not for the discounted price. So if I can go to Paidville, you would pay me for gas and time? Come? Are you serious? I have a feeling that beggar is dead serious, that they feel like if they're going to do something to get an item for a discounted price, they need to be benefited on top of getting said discounted price. This next one is from Tiana D. Hey guys, looking to start my first year carpentry apprenticeship? I have three months experience and I think I'm already good enough for at least $40 an hour. I won't settle for less than $37 an hour. Based in the eastern suburbs, we'll, we'll need lift from and to my house every day. I would like three times the wage on Saturdays. Thanks, let no la. This has got to be a joke. I'm having a very difficult time putting the terms first year and $40 an hour together. I, I just don't understand how they feel they can command so much money if they literally have only three months experience. This next one is by Just Call Me Allison. Hi, I got my order this number and I noticed a lipstick that I did not order. Thank you for contacting us. A customer service representative will be with you momentarily. Hello? Hi there. I checked your order number and it looks like the lipstick you received was a free gift. We hope you love it. Thank you so much for your support. XOXO Fatal Beauty. Actually, I don't like this color. I tried it on and I love the formula, but not the color. Can you send me a different one to try? We are so glad to hear that you love the formula, but unfortunately we cannot exchange, replace, or credit a complimentary item unless they've been damaged or is defective. Okay, then just refund me for the lipstick. I'm sorry, I don't understand. The lipstick was a free gift. Well, it says it's $16 on the site, so just refund me the $16. Unfortunately, we can only refund the amount paid at the time of purchase. Since it was a free gift, you didn't have to pay anything for it. Wow, okay, I see you're just another scammer. I guess I'll have to go through PayPal and do a claim. By the way, lose the attitude and learn customer service. The only person that has the attitude here is the person who got something for free but were still dissatisfied and wanted money as compensation. I feel in the end, the fraudster will definitely get nowhere with PayPal. This next one is from Wondered Spirit. Donation amount, custom. Must be at least $35. These always make me cringe whenever I see that you have an ability to, oh, I don't know, donate, but then they have a requirement on how much you're supposed to be donating. It's like, don't all donations add up? I guess not to beggars. This next one is by Wixed Fizz. Hi there, just seeing if there's any au pairs, babysitters, childcare workers based in Begton who would like cheap board in exchange for their services two to three weeknights a week and every second weekend on either Friday or Saturday evening on average. You would not be required between the hours of 8am to 5.30pm every weekday. For context, I'm a single mom whose daughter is in full-time daycare, but I require support some weeknights. Would like to have someone here in the morning so I can go to the gym early and would like to have capacity to socialize every second weekend or so. You would need to have WWC, First Aid Cert 2, and referees available and be compatible with us. I think what concerns me is they don't list what the cheap board price is and I have a feeling that the cheap board price isn't going to equate to doing all of this extra service. This next one is from Inoculus86. 
Yes, we still have a few available. Were you interested in grabbing some? How many of you got left, please? I'm interested. Only problem is, we do not have transportation. We are trying to do up our yard. We have a disability. Can you please deliver for us to Wagga Wagga? No, it's pickup only. I would question why these beggars never try to think outside of the box and, I don't know, maybe procure transportation on their own end, but I think a lot of it just boils down to they're beggars and they want everything done for them and they want it done for free. This next one is by Christianic. In search of three TV stands, charcoal grill. In search of Peppa Pig house with the pieces, please and thank you. Three TV stands, nightstand. Thank you. In search of Peppa Pig house and accessories for child's B-Day and LOL dolls and dollhouse. Thank you. In search of nightstand, brown or black, please. Thank you. In search of fans. In search of shoe rack, nightstand, dark brown, small TV stand for child room, dark brown kitchen chairs. In search of white and gray pillowcases, please. And thank you. In search of pink and purple bedroom decor, like pictures for seven-year-old. Thank you. It's apparent that these were all posted at different times, but what if the irony was they were actually posted all at the same time, just broken up to avoid ending up on Reddit, but still ending up on Reddit anyway from overflow of posts. And our final one is by Atomic Blumpkin. Does anyone have a free boy dog that is potty trained and trained to sit and lay? That has a cage they will give away also? And that'll be willing to drop off to me? Whenever I see a post like this, the first thing that goes through my mind is if somehow they end up coming up with whatever they're asking, how many more posts will follow, asking for care, food, etc. for the pets? I guarantee a lot. Alright, that's enough beggars for the day. Well, that wraps up this episode of Choosing Beggars. If you liked the video, please drop a like, share my content on all of your social media, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload, and drop a comment down below. It really helps with the algorithm and helps new people find my channel. Thanks for watching, thanks to my patrons and super thanks contributors. Have a great day and stay safe out there.